Hello and welcome to my new series of Zend framework tutorials. First I'd like to say why I decided to do this. Zend framework already has an excellent documentation that extensively explains each component very well. Uh, you see it on the right side here. However, uh, due to Zend framework's flexible nature where the developer is not forced to use any one specific MVC layout, documentation leaves out the issue of directory structure. So, uh, when they give you uh, a sample code, they do not tell you uh, where to put it. So the newcomer uh, can get really lost. Like uh, in this example, uh, they show you how to set up Zend form um, and how to apply it. But if you're not familiar with how Zend framework handles the um, module view controller layout, you're not going to know straight away where to put this code. Uh, there are also good uh, tutorial blogs out there written by many uh, Zend framework developers, and I will reference a number of them. But uh, I found that they often describe uh, a component in a single case scenario. Uh, so it's difficult to see how it can be extended into a full application where it interacts with other components. So uh, I thought that I could make a tutorial from the point of view of Zend Framework Newcomer by showing step by step how to achieve an individual task uh, while at the same time illustrating how it affects your overall application. I do expect you to be familiar with um, PHP's uh, object-oriented concepts of classes, extending classes, private, public, and all of that stuff. So welcome and I hope uh, you will find these useful.